Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Angie and today I have a different video for you guys. So as you guys can see behind me, I have my IKEA pack system. I got this in December-ish, January, December-ish, I can't really remember. I got this pack system from IKEA and I've been wanting this for a while. Just always loved the way it looked in people's closets. I've seen that some people dedicate a whole room to having a pack system and I was like, this is so cute and I wanted to have one for myself. So I did get a mini version for myself. I only have it on this tiny wall in my bedroom, but I'm gonna be showing you guys videos and pictures throughout the whole video showing you how mine is set up what I got for it and everything included and I'm gonna list everything down below and I'll see if I can share my design with you guys in case you have a small wall in your room or you just want a small pack system like mine instead of like the really huge ones so starting off, I have two pack systems. I have the one with the five layers and then I have the one where I hang my clothes and I have three drawers and I also have this little mini drawer where I keep like my jewelries and everything. So basically the point of me having this pack system was just so I could have like all my bags and like, you know, my expensive things like laid out in my room. Just cute where like it's not tucked in my closet. The closet was so disorganized because I had everything everywhere. And I just wanted something in my room that was gonna make it look fresh because I did kind to redecorate my room I took a lot of old stuff out that I had from high school and I just bought a lot of new stuff and made it very minimalist but I think this is the only thing I will say is not simple in my bedroom but I love it so guys this is more of a review video than me showing you guys how I put it together because it's obviously put together already but guys I love this pack system so I did get two frames from Ikea and then I bought the little shelves to put in between so I did the really big shelf and I think I did the smallest one I think the one in between wasn't available that's the one I wanted but a lot of stuff were out of stock when you are purchasing your own you're gonna realize that a lot of things you want are there and a lot of things you want aren't there some are only available for delivery and some are not like it's just so hectic hopefully when you're getting yours you find everything that you want I knew when I was getting mine I had a little bit of trouble because I would make my design today and then a few days later I'll go back trying to see like you know try to spruce it up or just try to add some things or remove some things and I noticed that some things would be gone so the cool thing about the pack system is that you can create your very own you don't have to use someone else's design or the design that Ikea does give you I made mine from scratch and you can do that for yourself as well I'm pretty sure like like everyone else when you want to purchase something really expensive you do your research on it so I watched a lot of YouTube videos trying to see like people's designs trying to see how people did theirs like I mainly researched the small ones and I couldn't find that many because everyone had the really big ones but one thing I did notice is that everyone had the white shelves just like the white layout everything was white 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 and I was like it's not bad but it's not giving what I wanted to give and then I went on the Ikea website and I saw that they had glass I was like yes this is literally what I want so I literally got glass shelves and I got glass drawers as well the only thing I didn't get that was glass was the little pull out tray for my jewelry and stuff because I don't think that came in glass but if it did I would have gotten it in glass I feel like the glass just makes it look way more expensive it just makes it look finer and just more tasteful like the white is okay but it's giving like a drawer it's just giving basic I mean if that's your cup of tea then that's okay but for me I knew I wanted to kick it up a notch also because I got the little one so I was like might as well just splurge a little bit more since I'm not doing a whole room or a full wall of the pack so the way system. that I did organize my pack system I did it by color so I grouped my black things together I grouped my browns my, and like my miscellaneous colors all together like in different sections and it just helps me to visualize when I'm getting ready like okay I know I want to wear this color so I'm gonna be in this section and I'm gonna be in this section or like it just helps me to dress up and it just makes it look aesthetically pleasing to me so for my drawers I did organize them by like the way that I wear stuff one drawer is my going out clothes the other one is like my stay at home chill lounge clothes and then the last one is like my sweaters um, things that I wear during the winter time I just separated them in ways I knew that my brain would just be like okay just reach for this drawer don't have to like be going through each drawer and searching and like messing things up because once you get a pack system, it's also going to keep you very organized because you're going to like the look of it and you're not going to want to mess it up and you want to keep everything tight. Now let's get on to the price point. So for my pack system, I got the big and I got the small one. And keep in mind that I did get glass shelves as well. And with everything that I spent, I spent about $750. Uh, when I was purchasing it, I was like, I didn't realize it would be this expensive 
but after getting it i was like okay yeah i understand why it's this expensive especially if you get glass be prepared to spend a pretty penny because it is not cheap you do have the option of putting it together yourself but i am not doing any type of physical labor so i employed someone to do it i employed a woman to do it she was super helpful did a job exactly how i wanted it she made sure that like every screw was in place she tightened everything twice like i told her like i don't want this moving because i know whenever i do things myself i always just take the shortcut just to make it go faster she did the job really well i found her on TaskRabbit. i will link the link down below as well if you guys are just looking for some help in the area and you want to get someone to help you set up your pack system like i did the pack system is super chic it's cute it's giving it's giving black girl luxury it's giving soft girl aesthetic it's giving i'm living my best life you can see all my goodies put in one place together and it just looks so aesthetically pleasing i feel like I would purchase it again but I would probably do a bigger wall. My room is a normal sized room which is why I really didn't like the idea of having like a whole wall via pack system because I felt like it would just take up a lot of space in the room and just make it look very choked. If you have enough room then for sure go ahead and just get a whole wall of the packs like it only makes sense. And one thing I really do love about the pack system is that you can move it so I had the option of screwing it to my wall or just like making it very sturdy in my room but I told her no because you know you never know when you may want to move it when like you just want to move to a different room a different house you're moving like i didn't want to have it screwed to the wall and didn't know what to do with it and just left it here for the next people to come get it so i was like you know what just leave it like that it's super sturdy it doesn't move it doesn't shake so i was like you know what we're fine if it tips over then that's my fault the way that ikea deconstructed i don't think this is moving anywhere so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm trying to branch out and do some different types of videos not just hair and makeup all the time so i'm going to be doing more lifestyle videos than more like you know home vlogs more home tours and just you know a lot of stuff for the home because i noticed that you guys do like that a lot so if you did like this video make sure that you give it a big thumbs up make sure that you comment down below if you would spend this much money on a closet system and just let me know your overall thoughts and opinions and everything make sure that you do subscribe we are on the road to 10k subscribers i was saying 1k how long ago that i was saying 2k and now we're at 6.3k thank you guys so much for subscribing thank you for your love and support and i will see you guys in my next video bye